Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, Car Charms here. Hope you guys are having a charming day, and may I just say I'm glad you're here. If you're new to my channel, please hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate that very, very much. And I hope that you guys enjoy my content for today. I like when people are very concerned and it's really nice that he wanted to see if I'm okay because I was just, um, I was by myself at the beach. Well, there's people here, but I was on one side just like, I don't know, staring into the ocean, but I was going to go on Be Right Back like BRB and I turn to my right and uh, I see this guy just standing here and then he asks me if I'm okay so I'm very thankful if you're watching this ever Bobby that you was concerned to know like ask if I was okay but I'm definitely fine we need a lot of cool people like Bobby though and there's just so many people who just like drama and and fams and stuff like that no offense again to uh, fans, certain fans that don't like to uh, go back and forth, but I, I just can't deal with how fans are in PlayStation Home and here. So, yep, he said just checking, oh, oh, have fun. All right, so let me quickly get started with what I wanna talk about today. So yeah, this is gonna be a Let's Talk video. Prepare yourself, hope you guys enjoy it. Okay, this space had a lot of tasks to do and stuff to collect, and the space I'm talking about is the XI Museum. The first task we had to do was find scattered pieces of a symbol. Sorry, I don't remember what the symbol was. So, um, yeah, you find the pieces within the XI Museum. I'm sure it unlocks something to the next task. Now, I'm not going to go through every task because there's a lot to go through. So, um, I'm going to skip to the end. Once you complete everything, I remember there was a choice to make. The choice was to release XI or destroy XI. Um, but it didn't matter like what you chose because it's messed up either way. If the XI was released and a vi uh, if the XI was released, a virus, sorry, a virus breaks out and messes up everything. If the XI was destroyed, you, um, you allowed something bad to take over freedom and I don't can't remember what else destroying the XI does. Now what was cool was being able to see a realistic version of Jess, or should I say Jessica, who is the whole reason for doing XI in the first place, right? She explains that we was tested and see what um, skills we had, I think. And that's all I can remember about that space. Because um, doing the task was a lot of fun. And some of the task was hard. I, and uh, the puzzles that we had to do was hard. <laughs> but other than that, I think I kind of like, it's a place where you could just also just hang out with your friends and whatnot. But yeah, so that's really all I can remember about that. Wait a minute. Um, you do get an XI trophy also. And also be sure to um, let me know down in the comments what you remember from the place. But yes, you do get like an XI trophy. Before I continue on to the next Let's Talk space, um, I want to discuss the invisibility of the avatars. I know I've said it a couple of times in the videos that I've done already, but this is something that I can't deal with. <laughs> the fact that you have to, in order for them to see you, uh, you have to go into wardrobe and come back out. And that's a good solution for it, but I'm kind of getting tired of it now because uh, I had to tell her that I can't see her um, Abby. So, I don't know. If Nebula Realms is watching my video right now, can y'all please take care of this situation? And I know that if I was to say this in the communities, that they would tell me to either email, which I don't know, and I don't plan to because I don't know, I just don't plan to, or you can just say it on the forums. So it's either one of those two, and I don't feel like doing that either. Call me lazy, but I just, I just don't. And I like to just, you know, 
tell what bugs need to be fixed and whatnot on my channel. That's how I prefer to do it. So whoever sees, whoever doesn't, you know what I mean? So it's just, it would be better if they could also focus for the first quarter of 2018, as they say, fix the visible avatars, please. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, let's move on now. All right, so let's also talk the Sodium 2 Project Velo City Public Space. Can anybody remember that place? If you do, comment down below. But I can't say that I went to this uh, space a lot. Um, maybe it was because I wasn't into racing. So this was a space where you can race in customized Velo City rides. I think you call them. Um, and go up against friends or other people or the same rank. Before I say anything else, again, please excuse any noise you hear in the background. All right, let's go. On with what I'm saying. So right where you go to start multiplayer, you can see the leadership board. I guess to see their time and maybe you can beat their time. Okay, so the Sodium 2 Project Velo City also had a garage to upgrade the rides with unlocked parts, right? And so if you really want it to, I guess, have good speed and turns, I don't know much about. I'm just going to say that. I don't know much about. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, you upgrade and keep up your with your opponents. I'm thinking that's what happens because... I didn't really wasn't racing that much and I didn't stick around to do anything to my ride to, I don't know, boost me. So um, feel free to correct me on that. You guys are also, uh, can feel free to comment if you remember anything from this space that I probably didn't even address. For me, racing was okay, a little bit. All I remember was trying to like avoid being last place. I didn't even care if I was third place. Anyway, cause I'm not really competitive. I've said that before, I'm not competitive. Besides a little bit of Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> a little bit competitive there, but I'm not that competitive. Let's just put it that way. Anyway, the space had a shop with items from the Sodium Universe and uh, items from Lockwood. You know what, since they're putting like more stores into Nebula Realms, how about we have Lockwood, Vimy, In Dreams, exclusive stores who's with me because those are good stores by the way um granzella let's bring them stores in all right but back to what i was saying then there's always the uh there's teleports to the sodium hub or the salt shooter game which is the personal space which i don't know if i owned or not um okay so that's all i got for you guys today i just again want to say how excited i am for the nebula realms 2018 goals but we're just focusing on the space decoration uh, and the game uh, performance for the first quarter of 2018. And like I said before, I think the, um, the goals are not going to be in order. So as for the remainder of this video, I'm dealing with an invisible, um, I'm dealing with an invisible avatar. I know I made the screen blurry. That's because there's drama around me and there's just a bunch of I don't even feel like getting into it because some people on here just like to have drama just crowd around them. I don't know. Yes, you can block them. Yes, you can report if you feel like they're being that disrespectful to you. But it's just ridiculous how people fight on the video game. Internet. Hello. Relax yourselves. It's just crazy. And I'm not even meaning to talk about this, but I'm seeing in the comments and I'm like, how can y'all just go back and forth on a game? Like, y'all guys got to be internet thugs or keyboard thugs and stuff like that. Or prove who's better. Chill out. Like, really. All right, that's all I'm going to say on that. Because if I keep going on, the, on that subject, I ain't going to shut up because it never ends. It never ends. Like on PlayStation Home, they brought it over to Nebula Realms. Never ends. Okay, so I'm just here at the freaking uh, Nexus and I'm just chilling and I know I'm around people who like to troll and start doing some drama and I'm like, I'm hoping they ain't messing with me because I'm not in the mood with, for it. I'm not. But um, as you can see, I'm standing here and you can't see who I'm talking to, but I am talking to somebody with the green bubble, Cashville, 
and uh, I can't see him. And I don't know if he can even see me. He probably did. He said he saw everyone. Well, yeah, so um, I don't have much to say at this point. Other than check out another gameplay that I've been doing, which is The Sims 4. Those who like that type of game, head on over there and uh, check out my videos there. Because after this video, I'm going to have to work on uploading another Sims 4 video for those who've been watching me play it and enjoy my Sims 4 gameplay. Okay, now I'm going to close out this video. All right, if you guys made it to the end of this video, God bless you. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate that very, very much. All right, have a great day. Have a charming day, and I'll see you guys next time. Please check out my Sims 4 gameplay, and I'm out.